Deshaun tough, but sweet. Hey, you guys. It's Deshaun. Today's weather is going to be thunderstorming all day long. Right now it's 74, but the high is going to be 88. So let me know what type of weather you guys are having. Where you are, is it... Uh, is it raining like they say it probably thunderstorming all day it ain't started raining yet but i know from talking to y'all y'all said that it has been raining bad where y'all at so i guess it's leaving y'all and coming to us so you know let us know what's up hey y'all i'm i'm kind of in my feelings right now because my girls are now in camp yes you heard me they they now go to camp and you know they're they're big girls and they learn a lot at camp and they have fun and woo to woo but i'm just i'm nervous because they're not they're not with me and i'm just you know this this you know they're gonna be in camp for the for the summertime and I know that they enjoy it they have fun but I just I be so nervous you know because anything could happen but I know God got them I know he's going to protect them and keep them safe yeah but yeah my girls are in summer camp and I'm happy and at the same time, I'm scared. I'm happy because it gives them a chance to get away from me and explore and learn new things and meet new people. And, you know, <laughs> I just, I don't, I don't know, y'all. I don't know. Like, my girls, like, they, they are people who, they, they are people person they like people they like they like to entertain people they like to make people laugh they like to laugh and have a good time and yeah they have a good time here with me but it's like i learned mom you don't want to be around your mom all the time you know they i've noticed like they're really clingy to me like they they be literally clinging to me so, how was the first day of camp? Good. A little bit. A little bit? Yeah. What, what made it just a little bit and not a lot of bit? I missed y'all so, so much. I missed you too so much. Because someone was pulling on Chi Chi's shirt when they were saying, come here. And they were trying to play with her. Was who who was someone? Was it a kid or an adult? A little kid. Who was Chi Chi age? Oh, it's okay. Do you know she, this? She was pulling real hard. Well, you know, some kids play rough, you know? It's okay. And then Chi Chi almost fell. And, it, I, and it's okay. I, I was eating pizza because it was time for us to eat and we ate some pizza. Y'all had pizza? Yeah. What I, kind of pizza? I had cheese and pepperoni. Oh, your favorite. Cheese is my favorite, too. That's what I said. Cheese, cheesy pepperoni. Well, I'm glad y'all enjoyed yourself. And, a little bit. Uh, okay. Can you sit up, please? Thank you. So, why, tell me again why it was just a little bit and not a lot of bit. The, the little bit, it was bad. Because Chi-Chi, Chi-Chi didn't, Chi-Chi... So that that's what what Chi -Chi you didn't like is the pulled. part about Chi Chi clothes getting pulled. Yeah. Well, that that's okay because kids probably, play rough. Probably, probably it can like like you know how when I when I was doing something to my shirt, mm -hmm. um, it popped. I thought that was gonna happen to her shirt. Well, it, let me tell you something. Kids, little kids play rough. So if a little kid was pulling on your sister, it's okay because little little kids play rough. Long as it wasn't a big kid pulling on your sister. Now, if it would have been a big kid pulling on your sister, like a kid that's older than Chi-Chi, bigger than Chi-Chi, fatter than Chi-Chi, 
then it would have been a problem. But if it was a little kid, it's okay because that's how. She was so. like, she was right here. So, see, like I was saying, is when, when there's um, little kids, sometimes they don't know how to communicate and talk to each other, so they, you know, pull on each other. It's okay if it's a a little kid pulling on your sister, as long as they it's, was talking. I understand. They said, come here, come here. She, she didn't want to go, so she they pulled on her shirt and she can come. That's what I'm saying. And then she, they, she was doing it. She was finna start crying. And so that's the, that's the and thing. And then a grown up came and said no. Um, she was finna start crying. Then they stopped. And they let go of her. That, that's what I'm saying. They're they're little kids, so they don't know how to. Like she was telling her to come here, but Chichi didn't know how to tell her. No, I don't want to come with you. I don't want to do what you're doing. Like Chi Chi, she 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 did this. Yeah, that's what she did. But that 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 person, they probably didn't understand what Chi Chi was saying. Like that's what I'm saying. That they haven't learned how to communicate with each other because I, know, I already know how to communicate. Go, it's because you're older. They they are young or whatever. But besides that situation, you enjoyed yourself. Yes. In the in the lot was. So what what did y'all do? When it was a lot, when we liked it. Y'all did what? When, when we liked it. You talking about when? We yeah. Liked it? What what did y'all do? What part did you like? The guessing game. Y'all played a guessing game. Yeah. Was it a lot of kids? The, like six or four. Mm-mm. That's not a lot. That's good. I'm glad it wasn't too many kids. Yeah. You know, because it would have been too many kids then. But let me tell you something. I, I did miss y'all a lot. I really, really, really did. I did miss y'all a lot. But let me tell y'all something. Y'all stink. Y'all stink. Y'all need a bath. So y'all finna get in the tub because y'all... Y'all is funky. Y'all stink. For real, for real. Y'all smell like y'all. <laughs> yeah, did y'all play outside? Yeah, soccer. Yeah, that's what y'all smell like. Y'all smell like outside. Like little puppy dogs. Puppy dogs, they're inside and outside. Yeah, but that's what y'all smell like. Because we was inside and then we got outside, inside, outside, inside, outside. Yeah, but I'm just telling you. Y'all, y'all, y'all stink. Y'all finna get in the tub. Y'all smell like little puppy dogs. But I'm glad y'all enjoyed yourselves. Puppy dogs don't like cats. Well, I, if I was a puppy dog, I would bite these. Okay. <laughs> you guys, so I'm on the way to my doctor, the um, the WAP doctor. You know the <laughs> the female doctor. Cause I want to talk to her about about my body because ever since I was a little girl, my cycles have been crazy. So I don't get regular cycles. Sometimes I go months without a cycle, and it really has never bothered me. Like I don't mind not having cycles, but the thing is, you do want to know when it's coming like you know like like everybody else they can say oh my cycle normally comes around this day or this date or whatever i can't do that because i don't have a normal one and y'all remember that time when my my boobs were leaking i was like Okay, yeah. I'll, seriously, I'm trying to talk to y'all and I keep getting interrupted. Somebody knocking on the door, somebody calling. You guys, it has been a busy day. So, yeah, I went to the doctor. She said everything cool. She said it's okay if my cycle doesn't come every month. She said, that is fine. She said, 
with the issue with my boobs leaking. She said, that's just a reaction to all the medicines that I am on. Um, they're, they're not leaking anymore. It's, it stopped leaking, so I'm glad for that. But she was like, it, everything is normal. She she ran tests on me and everything. She said, everything is fine. She said, it's just because I'm on so many medicines. Now, the thing is, <laughs> I told her, I said, I've never had a regular period. Even when I was just younger, I was like, when I was a little girl, it's, it's never been regular. I've never been that person that gets it. Um, the same time of month. I was like, I've never been that person. Sometimes I would go months without it. And y'all know when my girls, you know, you know when you're pregnant, you don't have one. And then you know when you uh, breastfeed your kids, like when you do on-demand feeding, like my girls, they were on-demand feeders, meaning they, they ate a lot. So I didn't have no cycle. So, no cycle while I was pregnant, no cycle while they were nursing. So, <laughs> I've been without one for a long period of time. And um, <laughs> I'm okay with that. Like, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm okay with not having one. Because when I don't have one, People tell me that my skin is, they say my skin is really nice. They say, I, they say I'm different, <laughs> like a good different, you know what I mean? So I'm okay with not having one, but I, if I am going to have one, I want to be sure of, I would, I would like to know when it's coming you know what i'm saying because i don't get i don't get cramps i don't get uh all the signals and signs that you know people get i don't get that it just it come and when it come it's not for long is i my cycle is very light and it you know it's just for a few days that's it so i'm okay with that but I wanted to talk to my doctor and make sure it was okay. Make sure nothing was wrong with me. Make sure the man in me wasn't trying to take over. <laughs> but yeah, she said everything okay. Y'all let me know if your cycle is regular. Uh, do you have a cycle? Let me know. Like, what do you do to... Take care of your cycle. Like, is there any secret home remedy? Or <laughs> let me know, you guys. Thanks for watching.